Hello everybody, Flash Notion back with another My Little Pony based reaction. Uh, we've got episode 25 of Scooter Tricks the Abridged. Yes, finally another episode of Scooter Tricks and um, should be a very interesting one because this is the party of one episode and this is going to be their Discord episode. <laughs> oh... Yeah, and the last episode ended off very creepily uh, with some footage out of um, the Baby Cakes episode. And yeah, Discord is free and he's completely destroyed the fourth, or at least Pinky's ability to use the fourth. So <laughs> this ought to be really cool. Um... I don't know how much of a mind screw this episode is going to be, but yeah, I'm just really looking forward to seeing how this goes. So we've got 10 minutes of footage here to watch, and we'll start watching it in 3, 2, 1, play. And we've got the intro that's glitching out. Uh, the theme song glitching out, the credits glitching out. <laughs> uh. Uh, what happened? Hi, oh, Pinky. Good. You're awake. <gasps> that yes. is a really creepy voice I'm for Discord. I'm going to kill you. Yet. Who are oh, you? Oh, God. This is like some cupcake shit. <laughs> I am the great puppeteer. The master of chaos. The god of the fourth. My name is Discord. God of the Fourth? Oh. There's no God of the Fourth? Are you sure? Why don't we just check the script? Oh, wait. You can't see it, can you? That's gotta be just some sort of trick. You can't stop me from reading wow. the script. Wow. There are rules. And who's just the... writing those rules now? But you can't just make stuff up. There are consequences. I am the consequences. Every oh, time wow. you broke the fourth, you weakened my stone prison. And now, truly anything is possible. The wall is broken. Oh god, I the editing is going to be great. I mean, it's already great. <sighs> oh, the whole war. Damn. Oh my god. What the fuck is this shit? <laughs> Oh god! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god, and there's the crystal- Oh my god! This is incredible! Hi Luna, joining your sister. Oh my god. Today, the war in the north ends. I yeah, I don't think it's gonna end exactly how you think it will. By the time our troops get close enough, the zombies will be reinforced tenfold. Now is our only chance. I need to eliminate the princesses. But how? Perhaps... Oh? What is this? Huh. A choice. And with one small change to one word. <laughs> Goodbye, oh God. Celestia. What are you doing? Just rewriting um... some things. You can't hurt Celestia. She controls the sun, you'd never- <laughs> Don't be too proud of that tyrannical terror. The ability to move the sun is insignificant oh my God. to the power For of Star the Wars fourth. Well, if you're Reference. so powerful, why don't That's you just fight them yourself? Great. I have more important issues at hand. For instance, I've got to kill you and your friends. What? Why? Why you can't? Bears. There is no escape. God. I mean, so far there's, like, nothing from the original episode. Hello, Sombra. Ah, uh, Princess Celestia. King Sombra. Holy Aunt shit, she looks badass. Nemesis. We meet again under the most unusual circumstances, yes? Yes. Holy shit! <laughs> that was Celestia, funny, but... Celestia, you blind idiot. You fight for the good of pony kind. Fool. You fail to see the darkness that lurks in all ponies, like the hey, true disease. That, that, 
but really? That's your big villain speech? What? Oh, yeah, no pony's truly good. There's evil in all ponies. Yeah, yeah no, I mean, duh, I'm pretty sure that doesn't Celestia... Have to be evil. What? Whoa, now hold on. I've been working hard on this. I took a writing course at the community college. Oh my god. You really said that the last time we fought. No way. Did I? You never get any better at this. Well, maybe if you didn't kill me so much, I'd get better. Well, maybe if you didn't suck. Wow. <laughs> Every time we go through this, it's the same old shtick. You never learn. Weren't his eyes... Just oh no, they're only green when he actually uses his power. Celestia! <laughs> Oh, were you monologuing, Celestia? Looks like wow. I did get better. And you suck. <laughs> yeah, and your face. <laughs> well, well, well. Princess Luna. It's been such a I long like the armor. Time. What did you do to her? She's fine. For now. Release me. Actually, I thought we could have a little chat. She's so cute. <gasps> what the hell? You can't. You can't kill anyone. There's no footage of it. You're still bound by the footage. Thank you. You're so limited. Ever hear of Patreon? We have supporters now and a oh budget. Oh my god. Thank you, Editing. Editing. Really appreciate your contribution. Wow. A real hero, buddy. Now, perhaps there's not wow. much in this canon, but there is a lot of fan content out there to choose from. God, he could use. I'm begging you, don't kill my friends. He could use oh, anything. I won't be killing your friends. I want to have some fun for once. So, you'll be killing them. Oh my God, cupcakes! <laughs> no. <laughs> for generations, the Empire, <laughs> the Changelings. In fact, all other races of this world have suffered under the reign of your I mean, they're already sister. using, uh... What? Equestria has been at peace for a thousand years. <laughs> you mean in pieces for a thousand years. <laughs> you see what I did there? Yes. With peace and peace? I took a class. Yes, Seriously? I got it. Thank you. Your sister Sombra, you suck. <laughs> and fraud. Equestria well, yeah. has been fighting war after war after war well... for centuries without end. Well, I'm sure... Celestia is no hero, Luna. As a matter well, of fact, yeah, but... she's the most evil creature on the planet. You're one to talk. You literally have armies of zombie ponies. Ow. Hurtful much? I prefer to think of them as the chronically unemployed. And well, I'm helping them. I... Zombies? Luna, what if I were to tell you that this entire conflict, the entire war itself, had all been engineered by Celestia? Ah. Uh... I won't Hello, disbelieve Pinky. it. The bird. Oh my god. How are you doing? Um, doing fine, I guess. Hey, you know the bird. We never do stuff together. Y you know? Um, I guess. Yeah, we god, should do something. No. You know, just, just the two of us. Have some good <laughs> not old cupcakes. quality friendship time together. Not cupcakes. Just... <gasps> we are not doing this. Why don't we bake some cupcakes? Baking. Baking. I only need your help making them, you know. I'll do most of the work. And here, I made you a cupcake. Oh. Wait, what? Why don't you eat it, the bird? Uh. Eat, it? eat it? I made this one just for you right before you got here. Um. Well, I'm kind of on a diet right now. Oh, come on. Yeah, bird. also. The yeah, they're not. not they're not their ya? canon yeah. counterpart, so, uh. It'd cupcakes are, uh. I promise. It would seem a bit well, weird. Well, I mean, she's not well, stupid. Actually, the girls are having a picnic, and we were wondering if perfect. You oh my God, it's gonna go with Smile HD now. I'll see you there then. <laughs> oh, I'll be there. I'll be there. Are we? Are we Have seriously gonna do that? Why Celestia does such crazy things? Send no, we're not gonna do that. Dragons, handle biological weapons. Why she burned out her own eyes with a telescope? How do you know about all that stuff? I mean, Crystal that one has many spies, and sometimes she'll let me fun. in on some of the more mm -hmm. juicy information. <laughs> Celestia is desperate for excitement, something new, messing with yeah. enemies, having multiple arch nemesis, just hoping for something to go wrong. I mean, she's been alive for thousands of years. She's probably bored as hell. What's the harm in looking right at the sun? Her eyes are just going to regenerate by the next day. She lives without consequences. How else can she feed her boredom? Well... Look at all she's done to you. 
She has sent you to the moon for a thousand years. Yeah, she care about because you. Luna care about turned anyone. into a she kind of a bitch for a little together. while. We can end this war right now. We can bring in the new age right now. But you... Put myself in as ruler? No, I wouldn't. With Celestia gone, you could rule over Equestria. Just think, right. with Celestia she gone, tried that. It didn't exactly work out. A thousand years of world peace. So, what do you say, princess? Also, what is this from? This looks like it's from something. No, we're not doing this. I just watched this video again. I don't want it. <laughs> Please tell me something intervenes here. <laughs> I think he knows what's coming. Oh, God. Aww. Please no, please don't show it. Oh thank god it caught. Oh, wait, that was the end of the episode? What the fuck? Ah. Uh. Well, they didn't show it. <laughs> I wonder if they got permission from Mr. Davy to actually use that. Uh, well. <laughs> I, I'm halfway between wanting to cry and laugh because that's awful. We all know what happens next after that. And the sad thing is, is that it would fit with the circumstances. Discord's... This version of Discord and this version of Pinky and... What happened in Smile HD would actually fit with the circumstances. Oh my god. <laughs> That's awful. And then they tried to do cupcakes and they... If that had worked, it would have been Cupcakes HD. God. That's so twisted, though. There was barely any of uh, the actual episode, though. And most of it, I feel like... Well, not most of it, but like... There was a lot of Discord vectors and Pinky vectors at, at, in the very beginning. And that was just really cool to see. And then we went into the big war segment, and holy crap, a lot of that was just completely original footage um, that they edited together of, uh, yeah, all the soldier ponies and the zombie ponies and the blimps there. Well, zeppelins, I mean. Um, yeah, that was huge. And then... I feel like the stuff with Sombra and them fighting, I feel like that was, um, I feel like that was from something, but I don't know what. I, I know there's a lot of famous stuff out there that's like Luna and Sombra working together and being like love triangle weird stuff like that. I don't know what it all is. It's weird. That's like super early days fandom technically um, before I was around and I've just never really had much of an interest in going back to that stuff simply because it's since become kind of discredited, number one, and number two, just I don't know. I never really had much of an interest in the Luna Sombra story or ship, whatever you want to call it. I mean, even even the the Sombra uh, Celestia ship, which is, I think, supported by uh, canon, like, comics, um, I'm not really into that one either. It just always felt weird, especially since the comics also established that Sombra is, like, the living embodiment of, like, shadows. He was, like, created by a it's weird. Weird, weird, weird. 
Um, so yeah, I, I never really shipped the princesses with him, and this this uh, whatever fan work this is from, I I never felt any interest in looking up stuff like that. So I I don't know, but I'm pretty sure it's a a fan work that already existed and they just got permission to use the footage and yeah it, w- it was really actually really cool I love the armor designs for uh, Celestia and Luna and yeah uh, pity that Luna didn't really get a chance to attack but obviously that was not the point the point was the drama of uh, um oh oh I just realized Discord was like, there's going to be a choice, and it's it's probably going to be Luna's choice that he's trying to influence. Yeah, what's going to happen in the next episode? Because the next episode is supposed to be the Grand Galloping Gala. I'm get I'm my my bet is that the very end is going to be the guys a party to celebrate that they won the wars and defeated Discord and everything. Um, but it like that's going to be it. All the rest of the footage is going to be. Like, they made it up, and they spliced it together all on their own. It's with maybe a little bit of the fan content type stuff uh, put in there for good measure. Um, yeah, I, I don't feel like there's going to be anything else on top of that. Um, or, like, from that, from the from the main one. Uh... I have to wonder if there's going to be... Like, how many more specials can... Uh, can Tricks do? Because, like, they're planning on ending the series with, uh, with, uh, just, they're not going to be doing a second season. I've asked that. I know other people have asked that. I know that they've answered it in Q&As and stuff. They're just going to be doing the first season, and that's it. Um, and they're going to be ending all of this before, before the end of the second season. I have to wonder, like, they haven't uh, exactly brought up the Changelings in a while. I wonder how they're going to deal with that, because, well, I, I suppose they could splice in some footage of uh, of a Cantalot wedding. Uh, I don't know. Um, I mean, if I were going to give a suggestion, my suggestion would be to have the finale be, like, double length. Simply because there's so much to deal with, it might actually be easier to script it out all out if it's a double length thing, um, and you wouldn't have to cut as much. Yeah, it would be more editing, but I, as a fan, would be perfectly willing to wait longer to get it if it actually, you know, gave a good pace and it was like took care of everything instead of rushing it. So, yeah, that would be my suggestion. Just double length. Up- finale there um but beyond that uh no it's, it's this is just a yeah it's a fun episode and this show has i i guess become more serialized i want to say like um uh, if if you watch black lightning on the cw it's kind of become like that where it's like you can't just tune into one episode and get a nice neat little story you have to watch all the episodes together. Almost like a Netflix show, but even more so. Like, on Netflix, each episode still has its own internal plot and internal conflict, and everything gets wrapped up pretty well by the end, usually. Um, with a little teaser hook for, you know, the next episode to keep you watching, naturally enough. But, like, Black Lightning and this one, it's kind of like there's an overarching story. And you do do have, like, a couple of little mini stories that go on every once in a while. But for the most part, it's a case of you got to watch it all as the ball starts rolling. And you just... Yeah. Um, I do have to point out that uh, the, the, the uh, sun burning out the eyes thing, that's, that's from uh, the Royal Correspondence thing. Which is like a complete side story that not everybody will have necessarily watched. So it's that that would be like a, a Marvel movie nef- referencing the Netflix series. So it's kind of weird. Um, I'm glad they did it. It's kind of rewarding for people who watch the Scooter Trick stuff. It's just a little bit weird. But hey, 
whatever. Um, so yeah, this was... It, it's hard to rate it as an individual episode, but as just an entry into this, this was gripping and exciting and really cool, and I I desperately want to find out what happens next. I want Luna to just shut Somber down, and Celestia gets up, and they kick his ass, and then, you know, they go and they kick Chrysalis's ass, and that's all finished, and Pinky finds a way to break free of Discord's control and save her friends. I kind of hope that they also maybe just pick up in the aftermath of that, where Pinky's just, like, really... Like, they can't use the full, uh... The, the fullness of the uh, Smile HD because she destroyed the planet at the end, and I'm pretty sure Discord doesn't want that to happen. Um, I don't even think you would want the Fluttershy beating her up part to happen. And heck, like that shouldn't happen anyways because Discord wouldn't have augmented Fluttershy in any kind of way. So it, it would basically be up to the part where Pinky starts crying. I think we it would be kind of cool if like we started out on that where it's like Pinkie Pie st- like uh, blows up Fluttershy or somehow or just we start off with her crying in the aftermath of it all and then we go into a heavily edited section of her talking with Discord and then I have to imagine that like Pinkie's somehow going to steal his power of the fourth like if anything is possible then obviously she should be capable of doing that she should be like okay then i'm altering the script so that i'm now the god of the fourth and you have absolutely no power and i'm going to turn everything back to the way it was and we'll just go from there (laughs) you know i I feel like that's going to be something similar to what happens maybe i don't know it'll be cool though no matter what and yeah, so that's that's about it. Uh, double length episode next time, hopefully, uh, defeating Sombra and defeating Chrysalis and defeating Discord. Um, it's mainly down to Pinky to defeat Discord at this point, I think. And yeah, this this is gonna be a very interesting finale when it comes out. It's also worth noting that when this finale comes out, this will be like the only abridged series sort of thing that has a definitive finale. Like, the the Friendship is Witchcraft one never had a finale, and, uh, like... Ultra Fast Pony has never had a finale, and it's still ongoing, and it's like... I don't know if he's actually putting out any episodes right now. Like, he would have he would have been on season 5 last I knew. But I haven't... Last I knew, he was just going back through and doing a bunch of commentaries over his own videos. And then maybe he was planning on doing the movie, just kind of skipping ahead. I don't know. Well, Carb can do whatever the hell he wants. But, yeah, uh, no finale there. And... I'm trying to think of what else there is, and just, this will be the only one that has a finale, and that would be really cool, um, also just kind of (laughs) weird, uh, but it'll be fun. And I do hope that there's a couple more, like, spin-off things. I know Royal Correspondence might keep going for a while, and... There might be a couple other specials. I have to imagine that they'll somehow do something with the movie. Maybe. Like, maybe maybe it's like a flash forward. Here's the movie. And that's, like, what happens after everything. I don't know. It would be kind of weird, though. Because, like, they dismissed Twilight's Wings in uh, the Equestria Girls thing as a case of larcenism. Huh. So I, I have to wonder, like, how they would manage that. Especially since Twilight's use of her wings is so natural in that flash forward. I don't know. Hmm. What would a Scooter Tricks movie look like? What would Starlight be like in the Scooter Tricks universe? We've already established, like, what T-Rex is like in the Scooter Tricks universe. They, they swiftly defeated him. It would be kind of interesting to see what Starlight is like. Maybe, uh... Like, we we haven't even 
Well, we did mention Star Swirl, didn't we? In like the the the, we had a freaking, we had a Halloween special. Yeah, we did. We had a Halloween special. Luna came down. And Twilight was like, "I'm Star Swirl the bearded." So Star Swirl definitely exists. Um. So yeah, there's just so much in the later seasons that they're not going to be able to use in this. It would be really nice to see their versions of it. So it would be kind of cool if there was just like a special or something that covered each of the other villains in some way. Like, here's Starlight, and here's uh, here, here's the Pony of Shadows, and here's... Uh, well, we, we're, we're dealing with Chrysalis, so we don't need her. Hmm... And Discord's obviously not going to get reformed in this, so we don't need that. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, I don't think Cozy Glow would necessarily... Well, no, Cozy Glow would work in this setting, because Cozy Glow could be, like, a former classmate of um, our three generals, and, like, she's, like, the best of them all, but she turned evil, and... That would be just... That would work so well in the Scooter Tricks universe, actually. <laughs> Cozy Glow would be a way more vil- believable villain for the Scooter Tricks universe than she would have, than she was in the main universe. That's hilarious to think about. <laughs> oh my god. Um, but, uh, and obviously we've got whatever comes up in Season 9, and we've got the movie, and the Storm King, and Tempest, and all that... And obviously, we only used, like, one of the Equestria Girls, uh... We only used the first Equestria Girls movie for that special, but we altered it so that Sunset... Sun... Sunset Shimmer is evil through and through, and Luna killed her. So, wow. I, I never really thought about it that, like that, I don't think. Uh, Luna... Luna murdered Sunset. <laughs> I mean, wow. This series is crazy. I'm going to hang it up now, because I'm super stuffed up in my nose, and i got to deal with that, and y'all don't want to hear that. So, I'm going to tell y'all goodbye, and I'll see you next time. Bye. (laughs) See you next time.